Why no one dares to go to the century-old cave on the cliff? Who built the artificial remains in the cave? The local old man revealed that this place is called Taiji village. In the 1980s, two people tried to enter the natural danger here. One of them accidentally fell into the 100-meter cliff. So far, Taiji village has become a permanent mystery. Today we use professional equipment. Go inside and find out. Judges, please do not imitate. Hello guys. Now we are at the top of this cliff. According to survey by drone, this mysterious Tai Chi race, right in front of me, below this cliff-like cliff. We now go from here. Ah, look for that cross-cutting route. Also with professional equipment, everyone must not imitate. Okay, let's get started. Put on this professional equipment. Full set up a body. Everyone must not imitate. Now we have an anchor. This anchor point is riveted to the big cypress over there. Very safe. It's safe. I think it's safe. Yes, it's safe. Look at this. It's fixed here. Us. Now I am the pioneer. Just drop down from here and start working. From the side of this cliff. Opened a line down. Protected now. I'll show you. Here is the crossing path. But going down from here has a certain angle. So we can only. Say from here. Make an anchor. Then pull people in and pull them into this angle. Then walk sideways through that path. Anchor all the way. Everyone must not imitate. Okay let's do it. I can vaguely see the small hole here. Alright let's make an anchor on this rock. Then cut across the hole. You can see it next to me. It's this. The cliff is not. Very dangerous. Everyone must not imitate. Can be seen. Look in the direction of the finger. That's the entrance to the small cave in Tai Chi village. But to cut across from here. An anchor point must also be made here. Otherwise, this mistake will become eternal hatred. I'm about to take this step now. You can see that there is no place to step on the foot at all. But now it's very safe. I put a lock on this stop. Then the oxtail is also hung on it. Then here is an anchor point made. Very safe. We move forward now. Oh my god I just watched it. It looks like someone is watching us down there. The front is getting closer. But the road is getting steeper and steeper. So at this time, we need to hit this cross-cutting anchor point. I crossed over there very safely. Then what? Take a look at that. The small hole in the Tai Chi competition. Come to the small city gate in front of me. Then I make an anchor point here. Then when they come, it's relatively safe. Then what? We went straight into the stockade to find out. They are cross-cutting. I'm the seat pioneer now. Already hit the anchor to the hole. Here comes. You can see that this is the Jai Men. The gate of Taiji village. It's a small hole over here. Then there is a big hole under it. So one yin and one yang. So it is called Tai Chi village. Then when I was making this anchor point. Suddenly found a stone monument next to this. This is also written in the year of Tongzhi Renwu. July what? Internet Heyang. Li Wen Sai. Li Wen Guang. Li Wu what? This is probably the name of some people who wrote it. It was then. It may be some of the people who built this Taiji village at that time. Person's name. Most of them are surnamed Li. There is also Zhong here. There is Zhong Xiaoming and Zhong Xiaoshen. I am Buddha. I can't see what. Let's go in and take a look inside. Are there any martial arts secrets? Oh my god. I'm protecting it now. Don't imitate. Below is the abyss. Very high. Okay let's move on. You can enter the cave now. As you can see. I have now come to this. The small cave entrance of Taiji village. Oh. Here is the cliff. Everyone must not imitate. Now I am wearing professional equipment for this protection. At this time, I will hit the last anchor point. They can come here very safely. Looking from here, there is a gushing path. The artificially excavated tunnel went deep into the cave. This gate is very narrow. Possible. This village. Just over one meter wide, this gate. And it's about one meter high. And the most important thing is to see here. 
This is a cliffhanger. Feeling very exciting. And this can be seen opposite the one where we fly the drone. The terrain is dangerous. This Tai Chi village, the reason why it has not been breached for a hundred years, maybe it's because of the mysterious location here, is very particular. It's really a good place that's easy to defend but difficult to attack. I don't know if there is something in it. Magical things exist. Let's go in now and find out. There's a doorpost hole under this one. Then the corresponding doorpost hole on this. May have weathered. Then I'm now inside the stockade. This is the tool we use to open the line. Okay, now we're following this man's path. Go deeper. Look at this below. It's obvious that someone drove away. And very smooth. About a 40 centimeters wide. Then such a swimming lane that is not too high. Inside is its interior. Oh my god. Then look at this bag. There may be a pile of dead bones in front of you at any time. But don't be afraid. It's no big deal. You can see that there are man-made steps. Keep going. Wow. There might be that big hole down there. If this area. Not very big. It's divided into one level. Two levels, three levels. I can't see it below. There are currently three steps that can be seen here. Wow. This dust can be seen here. It's been over 100 years that no one has set foot in. Then in front of that is the big hole. I just came from that direction. Wow. Really shocking. There are a lot of mice on this. Mark's walking on it. May now have become a abode of eagles. And there are many, many Yeming mountains. This means that at night, what about this? Correspondingly, the bat lives on it. And oh my god the comparison found here. A bit strange. You can see this. A bull nose here. And a very, very old twine. Hang here. It is possible that this village. The last wave of people. One possibility is. Left us through this twine. Um. Take a look at this below. What is the environment like below? Wow. This is local conditions. Bring over the stone that dug the tunnel over there. Built this hurdle. It can be seen that it was still carved with that fine wallpaper. The overall process is still relatively sophisticated. This is the big hole. Here, I found something very, very interesting. This is the thing. There must be many people who don't like this. No, but... I grew up in the countryside. Know this thing. This is called thread. It's something artificially cultivated. How is this linen used? I'll show you. Do you see it? This is the thing. It's skin. It can put it in the water after soaking. Let the surface of that skin corrode away. What about the fiber in the end? Can. Twist it into that very, very strong rope can make rope for the first time, I can make straw sandals for the second time, it's artificially cultivated, that is to say, this nest is numb, probably hundreds of years ago. Do you see it? There are more here. This is the one that hasn't been picked for a long time. He's already weathered and brittle. If, what about the first year, the dead thread hem put it like this in the second year, break it apart, then take off the top skin. What about its skin? You can take out the fiber inside. Make rope. Wow, the scenery here is really good. You can see there's a hole over there. There's a hole over there. There's another one across the way. There are three steps up here. It looks particularly shocking. There are so many ditches on the ground. Take a look. Can you dig one out for everyone to enjoy? If you lived in the countryside when you were young, that in that firewood stove inside the firewood stove inside the firewood snail at the door there is such a thing then everyone look at this thread this thread hemp it is cut around the horse there is such a flower the nurse is artificially filled inside then I picked this thread because of the thread it will only grow in this nurse 
Look here. Do you see it? This is all easy water lurse. Ah, and there is this burnt soil. Slag. Because the burnt soil contains nitrate. So it is equivalent to fertilizer. Hey 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 come on. There is a bowl. Do you see it? I get excited when I hear you call me. Well this is exquisite. Look. What is this? Dry. Qianlong. What is this? Wow it's gossip. Do you see it? Tai Chi? Tai Chi? Gossip about Tai Chi. That's why it's called Tai Chi Village. Maybe a Taoist. But I don't think it's porcelain. Isn't he called Jin Zhai? He is not porcelain. This seems to be a... Is it iron or something? Copper bar. This looks like Dushio. I don't know. Take a good shot. I'll take a look. There are plum blossoms. Do you see it? Here are a few. Look here. Very delicate. Qianlong what? Take a picture of this model. I can't see clearly. What is Qianlong called? I'll take a picture of this. Do you see it? This is dry, this is long. Um. Right. Look at this. The bottom of this and this has become a honeycomb. It was too long ago. Do you see it? Put it here. You carry it. It's not our thing. We don't want it. Let me tell you again, we're not treasure hunting. We just said to explore these monuments. That's not to say we're going to take the contents. Let's look around to see if there's anything else. That. What are you running? I see someone for money. But found nothing but some fragments. Hey, take the flashlight and have a look. There seems to be a secret passage here. There seems to be a secret passage. Is there a secret passage? You take a phone. Oh I have a flashlight. Come and see. I feel like it's artificially blocked. Come. Pour him. Take a look. The boss said, why is there something here? Because this place is obviously blocked by people. Look at. See if you find anything. Oops. So tight. According to the old man at the time. There are a few big boxes in here. This gold and silver jewelry. There are still guns in here. Wow. This looks like a horn. Do you see it? Much like a horn. There is a soil character. This is not this is not a local character. This is a four character. Yep. There are a lot of bowl fragments in it. A lot of porcelain. Hey, I think this stone is interesting. This is like a cow. Do you feel like he's a slippery head? Like a horn. Right like a horn. I see there is no lucky corner. Digging to see if there is any. This mound is a mound that was artificially placed here. Oh let's see this seam. There is no other porcelain in the seam. Wow well, look at this glaze. Underneath this pile of Yi Mingcha. I don't know if there will be anything strange. This, there's straw in it, see, um. He made three boxes of soil and probably filled the joints. Wow, I still have this green gang. The bark of the chingang tree.
No, it's just a pile of dirt here. Nothing. Just some bold scum. There's probably some construction debris right here. The overall area of the village is not that big. He may have close to 40 square meters here. Then add this step and this walkway. About 20 square. The hole is about 60 to 70 square meters. The overall structure of this village is like this. Now I'm ready to put on my gear. This is the overall situation of this Tai Chi village. Found a bowl right here. What about this bowl? I'm already back in place. I put it here. Everyone, don't say I took it away again. Then I found this green one here. Look at this. Wow. Look at this like turquoise. So far, this Tai Chi village has fully explored the inside. There are four steps in the big cave. Then there is a, a channel 40 centimeters wide to this big hole. His in and out. I can only rely on this narrow path under my feet. Very dangerous. If you don't have professional equipment, I don't recommend everyone to come and play. Okay, so this video is over here. Thanks for watching. Bye bye next video.